Hey guys, Vic here playing Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Today on Skyrim Revisited, we are going to go for one of the alternative armors. Uh, this one's under a miscell miscellaneous quest. This one is to get the alternative version of the, I don't know if, if I pronounced this right, Stalhrim, Stalhrim, ugh, Stalhrim armor set. Sorry guys, if this is pronounced wrong, I might, sometimes it's hard to pronounce some of these things. So, you'll have to go to Solzheim for this. Um, just go to the map and go all the way to this marker here. If you want a place that's the closest to it, Refugee's Rest is basically the closest I found. Just fast travel there. And then you can actually go through the quest thing and find the location there, which is pretty, it's near Skull Village. Now this quest you can purchase in Bethesda's Creation Club for 100 credits along with the Dwarven Male Alternative Armor if you're looking for, passage, the business, talk for the same price. Alright. I'm not going to do it that way. Just go to Skull Village. It's the closest to it. This is a very short quest. So, I mean, it's not too long. You basically have to just collect a journal, go to this other place, kill this um, enemy, collect the armor, and you're done. So from Skull Village, just leave the village. I'm gonna go this way. Huh, I'll have to check that out later. I just saw something on my map that wasn't found yet. So just go in this direction. You'll find a little camp. Or there'll be a dead skull villager. Right here. You have a lockpick, grilled leaks, and... You can if anybody wants some armor, really, I don't even know, it's coat, hat, boots, there you go. And then there's a journal. Not much of a journal. Doesn't write much in it, but it'll start a quest. Ancient Ice. Now, I'm going to deselect this, even though I don't think I have anything selected in there. And just... Press square if you're on a PlayStation. I don't know for Xbox. But the closest location to get there is Castle Karstag Ruins. If I even pronounce that right. So just fast travel there because that's the closest to the location that you have to go to. You'll have to drop down into water so be very careful when you get to this location. Oh, I thought that was something I could mine there for a second. So be very careful dropping down. You don't want to... If you drop down in the wrong location, you're going to die. And we'll have to... Um, you won't have to start the quest all over again. Just wherever it saved last is... You know, the autosave is where you'll have to start off. So just be very careful. Uh, going down... I'm going to have to really be careful going down. There we go. Yeah. Okay. I might be okay from here. Alright. So, you just keep going in this direction. Where the marker's showing. And there'll be some horkers or honkers or whatever those are. can kill them, but there'll also be an enemy. It was very easy to kill. Oh, 
mean, he really isn't that tough. I mean, look, he's hit me several times, and I've barely taken any damage. Just make sure he doesn't go in the water, though, because we won't kill him, and it'll probably switch. So, he'll have a weapon. This. Stalrim Battle Axe of Freezing. You can collect it to possibly sell it or whatever. And then there's a deposit there that you can... And you just collect the armor. And you're done. And I think it should appear in... Uh, your forges for if you want to forge it. But if you want to see what it looks like, here you go. It's not enchanted. And that's what it looks like. The alternative uh, version of uh, Stalrim armor. <laughs> it's actually not bad. It's not bad at all. I might enchant it and use it. I don't know. But yeah. If you like what you see and would like to see more, please feel free to like and subscribe. I normally upload videos frequently. Sometimes I may take a week and a half to do it. But usually I do upload frequently, like this one just right after I did the Dawn Fang and Dusk Fang one. I would like to take this time to thank those that have given me advice also those that uh, subscribe and like my videos um, I, it's much it's very much appreciated so thank you all for watching stay safe and have a good one